Hello, and welcome to Natasha's University of Life. My name is Natasha, and I'll be your teacher. Is freedom of speech important? To me, it's very important. Why? What can happen to society if freedom of speech is restricted or suppressed in any way or form? Well, the society will become antisocial over time, and the consequences of that can be devastating. For example, if you Google about complications, consequences, and problems related to the antisocial personality, you will find out that it's related to spouse abuse or child abuse or neglect, alcohol or substance abuse, being in jail or prison, homicidal or suicidal behaviors, having mental health problems such as depression or anxiety. Antisocial personality, sometimes called sociopathy, is a behavioral condition in which a person consistently shows no regard for right and wrong and ignores the rights and feelings of others. People with antisocial personality tend to antagonize, manipulate, or treat others harshly or with callous indifference. They show no guilt or remorse for their behavior. Individuals with an antisocial personality often violate the law, becoming criminals. They may lie, behave violently or impulsively, and have problems with drug and alcohol use. Because of these characteristics, people with this behavior typically can't fulfill responsibilities related to family, work, or school. Anyone who is limiting social activities like freedom of speech should be held accountable for the consequences of those actions. In my strong opinion, any establishment that is open to the public or serves the public that includes private and government-owned facilities should be protected by the First Amendment. Amendment 1. Congress shall make no or respecting an establishment of religion or prohibiting the free exercise thereof or abridging the freedom of speech or of the press or the right of the people peaceably to assemble and to petition the government for a redress of grievances. As well, freedom of speech does not mean freedom from its consequences. For example, we are not allowed to harm others with false accusations or fraud. Some people disagree with what I wrote, saying that we have freedom of speech already and cannot be held accountable for people behaving like a sociopath because of lack of it. I tell them if that was true then President Trump would not have to sign the executive order in March of 2019 to protect free speech on college campuses. Disclaimer, I do not support politics. I support the facts, and the fact is that Donald Trump did something good here. I will provide the website link in description window so you can see that event. Does God have anything to say about free speech? Definition of word suppress. To prevent the development, action, or expression of truth, feeling, impulse, idea, speech, etc. If you are interested, then please subscribe and comment on this video. Your comments and ratings can help me and others with progression. I am here not only to teach but to learn as well. And despite the contrary beliefs that some may hold, a good teacher is a good student. And if you do not want to miss out on upcoming uploads, then please click on the video notification. Thank you and have a nice day.